Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long time. I'm still trying to like get in the groove of life and schedules and full-time working and blogging and YouTube, but I think I'm going to be making it up to you this month because I am going to be starting an endeavor, which I'm not sure if it's a good idea or not since I have a commitment problem, but I've really enjoyed making YouTube channels and I really want to focus more on that and so to kind of push myself, I wanted to do something called 30 Days of Beauty. I was on Instagram a few weeks ago and I saw some beauty bloggers had been posting something under the hashtag 30 Days of Beauty and it's very similar to a photo a day where they would post just something once a day about makeup or some beauty related item and I thought that would be so much fun to do on my YouTube channel. Just a little something beauty related every single day for 30 days. So. <laughs> Here I am, this like commitment problems with my YouTube channel. I am going to be posting a YouTube video every single day for the next 30 days with something beauty related. So let's see if I'm up for the challenge and that I can do it. I decided for the first video, I will be starting with a Holy Grail products video. So these are my Holy Grail products. A lot of them I think you've probably seen on my channel before. Some of them I'm not sure if I have shared them. Um, actually, I think all of them. Not all of them have been shared, but so yeah, some of these might be a repeat, but um, I just kind of want to show you and reiterate the things that I'm loving right now in my makeup uh, collection, and hopefully it will kind of remind you of something that you want to try or should try. So let's get started. All right, the first item I'm going to talk about is from my skincare routine. It is the Aveda Embrightment Toner. This stuff, you guys, this stuff is the best. It smells amazing. Um, it's a toner that doesn't dry out your skin. It just really takes off a quick little surface. I feel like when I use this and put my products on after, everything just goes in better, it absorbs better. Life is just better with this toner in it. So um, I love it, you need to try it. Enough said about that. All right. My next item is the St. Ives Timeless Skin Collagen Elastin Moisturizer. I, I recommend this product probably more than any other thing that I use. It is like only $4 at the grocery store. It smells amazing and it makes your skin, oh I can't open it, yeah, it's, you know, I gotta get to the gym more. It smells amazing and it works wonders on your skin. It puts all that collagen and those elastins back into your skin that you need and that you lose over time. And you will wake up in the morning feeling amazing. Put this on before you go to bed and when you wake up, fresh, dewy, supple, gorgeous skin. Not exaggerating with this one. And for four bucks, like feel free to like just, you know, put it anywhere and everywhere you can put it. Anywhere. The Aveda Termaline Charged Radiance Mask. This mask is by far the best mask I've ever, ever, ever used. It, like, you feel it working and it is amazing. Sorry. Always noise around here. Um, it's a creamy facial mask. It's blended with finely powdered termaline, which is just an, an amazing, amazing thing for your skin. It's a... It's a naturally energizing um, mineral antioxidant. This is just like one night's rest for your face is what I like to call it. Like it just makes your skin glow and look and feel amazing. I have to talk about my Naked palette because I use this pretty much every day. I love it. Um, you know, I waited a really long time to get it because it's kind of expensive, but if you've thought about it more than three times, just go do it. It's the best investment. I swear I don't even use any of my other eyeshadows anymore. This is it. This is where it's at. Um, Urban Decay is just amazing with their palettes, um, as we all know. The color payoff, they last forever, it's gorgeous, they're versatile, so many different things you can do with them. You honestly don't really need any other eyeshadow ever. If you have a, a naked palette one two or three honestly but um, I love mine and it is definitely in my holy grail products I actually don't think I've talked about this on my YouTube channel um, I've talked about it on the daily dish segment here in Utah um, or was it on good things Utah I don't even remember this is the 
Real Techniques version of the Beauty Blender. I don't have my Beauty Blender on me. The Real Techniques is the more affordable option and the closest as you're going to get to what the Beauty Blender can do. This stuff will change the way your makeup, the way you do makeup. It'll change the way your makeup looks. It'll change everything. When you put on your foundation and then you put on your concealer, you blend it in with this. It just gives this really flawless airbrush look that you're just not going to get using a brush or finger. It's just, I forget the woman's name who came up with it. She was a makeup artist. This stuff's awesome. It comes out, it's like a really small little sponge and you put it underwater and you kind of pump it up and it like expands. And you know, I am going to tell you this because the first time I got it, I didn't really know how to use it and I put my foundation on it. Well, do not do that. <laughs> Um, as you can tell, mine is filthy because I've had this one forever, but um, you don't put your makeup on it. You put your makeup on your face and then you use it to blend it because it just like sucked up all that makeup and I was like, sorry, my bracelets are like smackling. It was just not cute and it was a waste of makeup and a waste of time. So for those who don't read instructions like me and are watching this, don't put makeup on it. But yeah, they, these are amazing. It's an amazing tool and it really does just blend out beautifulness across the face, which is probably why it's called the Beauty Blender. So yes, the Beauty Blender, you can get it like Sephora, um, Bloomingdale's, Nordstrom's, and this is the Real Technique one uh, version. I've never seen it actually in the store. Ulta holds Real Techniques, but I got it online. So if you're looking for that. I've talked about this little beauty. Um, this is the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. This makes your makeup last all night long, and it's just really fun and refreshing to put on when you're done. Every time I pull it up, I just have to put it on. Mmm! I love it. <clears throat> Man, I am on a roll today. What did I eat? Caf I had Cafe Rio and um, uh, Rita's custard with Italian ice for lunch today with Trevor, so <laughs> that's what that is. Um, this stuff is amazing. This is the travel size, but I will definitely be going back. Um, I bought it in the travel size because I wasn't sure if I wanted to commit to the price of the full size, but I can tell you I have been obsessed with it. I will never have this not in my makeup bag ever again, and I will be going getting the full size soon. This isn't a makeup product as much as an item. I've talked about it several times now on my channel because um, I'm obsessed with it. It's the e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush. Super cheap and affordable, blends out your makeup beautifully. Um, if you don't really have any makeup brushes, this would be one of the first ones that I recommend you go get. It's definitely in my holy grail products. Next one I have for you is a mascara, and I'm sure we've all heard about this, but this is the Benefit Their Real Mascara. Everyone is so into eyelash extensions and fake strip lashes and whatnot, and honestly, for every day, I just don't have time for that. And so I love using the Benefit They're Real um, because it has those little fibers that attach themselves and add just so much length to your eyes. And you can get this in, you know, I love, I do love the um, CoverGirl, I forget, the drugstore version of it. Sorry, I had to adjust my camera. Um, we are on like a basement first floor and to get any kind of decent lighting, I need to have my window open. and. Our neighbors are like out and about and you know it's just kind of awkward to have people staring at you while you're making a video. The Maybelline Falsies and the Benefit Reel, they're very similar but the Benefit Reel definitely outshines and would be my holy grail product because I feel like the formula is a little better and then what really does the trick is the wand. I love the applicator and I feel like it it attaches the fibers a lot better to the lash than the other one. And I just, I love this and I like to make it last a really long time by using mostly just a regular mascara and then I go through and do this to kind of add those tips. Whoa, I don't even know! <laughs> Alright, my next holy grail item would be the Hoola Benefit Bronzer. I've talked about this and featured it several times on the channel. It is just a great bronzer for anyone and everyone. If you haven't tried it, you need to. It's just pretty and matte, no sparkles, really great for every day, really great for contouring. This product has been in my makeup bag by far the longest. This is the Almay Clear Complexion Blemish 
heal technology. It is a concealer, but it has salicylic acid in it. I love using it because not only is it an amazing concealer, but it because of that salicylic acid, you know, it it really doesn't clog or make the blemish worse. In fact, it's healing it and adding, you know, medication to it throughout the day. So this is an amazing concealer, and I don't think I will ever use anything else. Um, definitely not for covering zits or anything. This is it. Um, I've had it since 2000. Well, not this exact one, but I've been using this since 2008. 2008. Um, so that's a long time to be in love with one product. So this is probably my holy grail of all holy grail products. That's pretty holy. So that was it for my current Holy Grail products anyway. Um, I am always trying new things and testing new products out. So every once in a while one gets thrown in there and I will definitely be sharing those with you along the way on this channel. Um, I'm really excited for this 30 days of beauty. So feel free to follow along. I'll be posting another video tomorrow and the day after that, and the day after that. You get the idea. Um, it's really fun um, if you want in if you want to include yourself, go use the hashtag 30 days of beauty. You can see all the other people that have been uploading on Instagram, all the different uh, beauty related items and whatnot. Um, my Instagram handle is Alicia Grace, so you can kind of find me anywhere online with that username. And I will see you later. Bye. <coughs> Sorry, that, that had to come out.